Greetings. Despite the changes our world has experienced this year, GIS is still here. In fact, GIS is more important than ever. The pandemic has raised global awareness of the relevance of GIS as a decision-making toolset that enables people, empowers people, encourages people to build healthy communities, resilient cities, and a more sustainable planet. Thus, GIS can be justifiably celebrated as never before, as an essential technology for applying geography and spatial thinking. One of the ways to celebrate GIS is through hosting a GIS Day event. A GIS Day event. Since 1999, GIS Day has served as a way of helping others learn about geography and the real-world applications of GIS that are making a positive difference in our society. It's a chance for you to share your accomplishments and inspire others to discover and use GIS. This year, GIS Day will be held on Wednesday, 18 November 2020. Mark that on your calendar, Wednesday, 18 November 2020, although you can certainly choose another day to celebrate what your organization is doing with GIS. Realizing that many GIS Day events will occur online this year, how can your government agency, school, university, company, or nonprofit organization host such an event? Whether you Zoom, Skype, Facebook, YouTube Livestream, Google Hangout, Adobe Connect, go to webinar, or use another method, I'm going to describe a selected list of resources and ideas for you. If the high attendance figures for online GIS-based conferences over these past six months are any indication, your audience this year for GIS Day could be much larger than in face-to-face -face only events of the past. Use this opportunity, therefore, to go big, go big. Think creatively about how to highlight the good people in your organization, how you use GIS, and the positive difference it is making to your community, and hence why it will matter to your audience. Teach a hands-on workshop. Focus on a tool that you're excited about, or perhaps a data set that your organization is proud to have created. Need additional ideas? Try this GIS Day story map. Show off some of your favorite maps in the ArcGIS Living Atlas of the World. I love the Living Atlas. What's not to love? The Mapping Hour is a series of hour-long videos that you could use for ideas on tools and approaches to teach and for instructional guidelines. Geo Inquiries and Learn GIS, those are other groups or bodies or libraries of lessons that provide additional content. See these stories that I compiled from a few of the 1500 GIS Day events held last year all over the world to discover what people have done to make this day extra spatial. Extra spatial, get it? Make it interactive. Create a map-based quiz or use existing ones such as Name That Place or Sounds of Planet Earth or Weird Earth or this collection of treasure hunts. You could even use Kahoot or another fun online quiz format in conjunction with maps and images. Put your GIS skills to the test with my new GIS themed crossword puzzle. Use it in your event as a contest, awarding kudos to the person or team to get the most clues in say 5 minutes or 10 minutes or 15 minutes. The resources pages on the GIS Day site provide additional lessons, posters, videos, and other items you could use. Need more inspiration? Well, how about 101 more ideas? Once you've gathered your team and planned what you will do, register your event on the GIS Day website. With your registration, you will receive a software donation, five ArcGIS for personal use licenses to each GIS Day host for you to give away as you see fit and event support, help with any resources or answers or questions that you might have. If you don't want to host an event, no problem. You could use the GIS Day web map to find an event of interest to you and join the event. Stay tuned, follow us on Twitter, visit the GIS Day website often to hear more about opportunities for the global GIS Day community to come together to celebrate GIS Day virtually with ESRI this year. So think about what will you do for your virtual or face-to-face -face event for GIS Day in 2020. Thanks.